Hi, I'm Caitlin Gomez here at the GBTA Broadcast Studio coming to you live from San Diego, California. And today I have Patrick Corey, Senior Director of Sales for Air Canada with us. Nice to see you. It's nice to see you, Caitlin. I love your here. Canada pin. You Thank are you. representing well. Thank you very much. <laughs> So let's talk about Star Alliance. Sure. Tell me about your new products and services. Absolutely. L allow me to begin, Caitlin, by saying thank you to you and all the men and women at GBTA for what you do for our industry. We personally appreciate it. Oh, that's so kind of you. Thank yeah, you. You're welcome. And we, we really mean it because you make our industry better. So thank you. Thank you. Um, I, as it relates to um, new products and services and what's going on with Star Alliance, um, there's a lot going on. <laughs> And uh, you may be aware that recently Star Alliance was awarded by Skytrax, the best airline alliance in the world. Oh, wow, congratulations. The, thank you for the third year running. Oh, wow. And to try to put this into some context, um, Star, uh, Skytrax award is a um, summary of 20 million people deciding who they liked. Wow. So that's a lot of people. And we certainly want to say thank you to those customers uh -huh. for their support and their loyalty. Uh -huh. And last year, Star Alliance flew 727 million people. Wow. In 193 countries, mm -hmm. over 1,317 cities, using about 5,000 aircraft. So the point of that is, Caitlin, no matter where you would like to go, I'm very confident that Star Alliance can get you there in style and in comfort. Well, that's, congratulations, because they say you win once, it may be a fluke, you win twice, you know, oh, you're looking good, but you win three times, that's yeah. something to be said. And there's another comment that I want to share with you, Caitlin, around new products and services, because mm -hmm. there's been a kind of a shift in strategy, you know, Star Alliance is, in fact, the largest airline alliance in the world. Mm -hmm. And one of the things we're now doing is focusing more on a seamless experience. Mm -hmm. And what that means is that we're using technology to help shape the customer's experience. And we use something called the digital services platform. Mm -hmm. And I'll give you three quick examples of how that works. If you have the United States, the home country carrier is United Airlines. And so if you have the United app and you're going on to Singapore, you could use the United app to get your boarding pass on Singapore. Okay. Conversely, if you were over in Europe and you were flying on Lufthansa, mm -hmm. you could look on Lufthansa app and say, where's my luggage? Because I'm connecting onto a member carrier. Mm -hmm. And then finally, we have something called a connection service. You mentioned the PIN. Yeah. If you're flying into Toronto uh -huh. and going on to Air Canada, um, we would keep track of Caitlin, say she's running tight to her schedule, we would make someone come and met you, mm -hmm. and you and your luggage would get connected to your next flight. So those are three examples of trying to really focus on a seamless connection and service. And that's and using, the benefit of having a very strong alliance, right? It absolutely mm -hmm. is, and really focusing on the customer. Mm -hmm. And there's also some new products and services we have around the world, which now allows for two stops, not three. And we opened up a new lounge in Rome, oh, which wow. I know your colleague was over there recently. Yeah, talking about so, that. well, so was I. Yes, <laughs> yes. We love Italy. That's yes. so. That's really cool, actually. Yes. So what are you most excited for about Star Alliance for the coming year? Well, winning think, again? Yes. <laughs> well, we're very proud of that accomplishment because yes, it's absolutely. hard to win more than once. Yes. Right? Um, I think there are many elements of this. I think for me professionally, the idea that we're going to focus on our customer and use technology to simplify the travel experience is mm -hmm. very exciting to me because when you put the customer at the apex of your strategy, you tend to win. Yeah. And I think for that reason, I'm very excited about it and using technology to help create a better experience for Star Alliance, I think is going to keep us in the forefront for mm -hmm. years to come. Excellent. I love the Canadian marketplace, uh, not because I helped Nancy run it for GBTA, but uh, I was kind of thrilled when they told me that I got the assignment um, because I just love doing business in Canada. It's very different from how you do business in the U.S. And so, you know, you, you kind of tread both lines, right, Air Canada, but for the U.S. And yes. so uh, tell me about the Canadian marketplace and Air Canada. Is there anything we should be looking for in the next year? Well, the Canadian marketplace is vibrant. Yeah. And um, Air Canada is a strong carrier as part of Star Alliance, one of the founding members. Mm -hmm. And I think you know, if you've talked to Nancy, that the people in Canada happen to be particularly pleasant to work with <laughs> and do business with. And I personally appreciate that. Yes. So there's lots going on between our respective countries, a great trade between the United States and Canada and around the world. Mm -hmm. And uh, quite frankly, um, Air Canada, as part of the founding membership of Star Alliance, sits in a very unique piece of geography mm -hmm. as part of Star Alliance. So I think that really adds a lot of strength to the alliance as well. That's awesome. Well, we really appreciate your partnership in Canada and here in the States and all over the world. And thank you so much for stopping and to talk to me today. It's my pleasure. Thank you. I'm Caitlin Gomez, live from the GBTA Broadcast Studio. See you next time.